on the stretch. Uh, but Gary, Mallory Blackwelder, part mm -hmm. of uh, the Golf Channel family already, as somebody who was on big break, right. and now part of the Golf Tour family. She's on the Symmetra's Tour. Uh, it's really great to have her back. We had her on before. Yep. She was the kid who went to the University of Florida, sight unseen on scholarship, halfway through her college career. Mom takes the job at the University of Kentucky as, as the golf coach, so she transferred up to Kentucky. It's been a family business. Mom was a great player for a long time. Dad has been a caddy to some of the biggest names in the sport, and we welcome Mallory back. Mallory, how are you? Thank you very much for getting up, spending a little time for us. Uh, before we get to what happened in the LPGA season opening event, let's start with you uh, where are you right now when can we be when can we see you play well good morning um, as we speak I am actually out in California so it's a very early morning for me um, but glad to be on I am going to start my season um, I'm hoping to I've, I've tried I'm asking for sponsor exemption into the only tournament in uh, in Phoenix so I would love to start my season with that event. If not, I'll try to Monday qualify and then head to Winter Haven, Florida for the first tournament on the Symmetra Tour season. Well, Mallory, uh, you know, Eric alluded to the first event on the LPGA Tour uh, just completing. It was a six-person playoff, and Jessica Corda, who is, you know, she's a teenager herself. Do you draw inspiration from these, these young girls and these young women winning, or does it appear that it means that, you know, the challenge for you is more daunting? Do you choose the former or the latter? Um. You know, honestly, I try to choose the former. Um, you know, obviously, we all take different paths in our golf careers. You know, I chose to go to college for four years. I am very glad that I did that. You know, I would not take that back for anything. You know, if I had ch turned pro, you know, a little bit earlier, maybe things would be different. But, you know, you can't look back on that. You know, I think it's it's amazing how well, you know, the young players are doing, you know, both on the men's and women's side. I'm so happy for Jessica. She's a great girl. Um, I've played with her a little bit, and I was I was really pulling for her. So, You mentioned that you went to college for four years. Lexi Thompson took a different road. She's already won twice worldwide. If you were going to give her advice as somebody who has more experience in terms of just years and decision making, you got to play for your mom, which certainly allows you to, to grow up that way. She's going to have her folks with her in a lot of spots as well. Uh, what advice would you give her to best prepare her for what she's about to embark upon this season? Well, you know, obviously she is, you know, she's an exception to the rule. She, Honestly, she had no business going to college. She absolutely, in my opinion, made the right decision. I mean, obviously, she's won twice. I think the only advice would be just to make sure that you still have fun with it. You know, after all, she is, she's still a kid, you know, and she still needs to kind of do normal things outside of golf. And, I, you know, I think it's really commendable what Michelle Wee did as far as, you know, she started young and she still went to college. And, you know, I don't know that Lexi will choose to do that. But I think the most important thing is just, you know, have a life outside of golf, you know, that, that you can kind of get away from it because it is, it is hard and it is emotional and, you know, I, I think that's the most important thing. All right, Mallory, we get Phil and Tiger today. I mean, everybody who plays the game of golf is a fan of, of you know, getting this, and then you have to decide who you're rooting for. Tiger, Phil, who do you like? I am personally, I have always been a Phil fan. Um, I, you know, I... Tiger's phenomenal. I'm I'm glad he's playing well again because I think that that's great for everyone in golf. You know, I think that golf needs Tiger to get back out there, and you know, glad he's starting to play better. But I'm I'm a little bit partial to Phil. Fair enough. Fair enough. Well, LPGA Tour off to an exciting start. Six person playoff. You were in a six person playoff every week when you were on exactly. big break. I mean, you're like six person playoff. That's Whatever. Right. You don't know anything about pressure. <laughs> yeah, that's what That's did you true. take, now that some time has gone by, what did you learn, what, what did you take, give me one good lesson through the Big Break experience that you can take with you that helps you on the course? Um, you know, the biggest thing for me, you know, like you said, I was in a lot of eliminations, so, you know, that pressure situation kind of stuck with me, you know, especially right after the season when we, you know, were finishing up the, the Futures Tour last year, but I really think that, you know, the most important lesson is you got to keep grinding because in golf anything can happen and you just never know. And Mallory, finally, the Symmetra Futures Tour, your number one goal in 2012 is what? 
Number one goal in 2012 is absolutely to get one of the 10 cards. Um, my, you know, my primary goal, I, I would love to be at the top of that money list at the end of the season. I'm very good friends with Kathleen Eke. You know, she finished number one last year. There's absolutely no, no reason I can't do the same thing. And, and I'm really, truly thankful that, you know, that there are 10 equal cards this year. Because we deserve it out there. You know, it's a long year, and we put in our time. And, you know, I think the 10 girls that that finish in the top, they we you know, we deserve to be on the LPGA next year. Excellent. Thank you very much for stopping by. We certainly yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, thanks for it. having me. We'll be uh, watching. You're part of the family now. We've had you on multiple I, times, and hopefully you're going to come back and visit us soon. I appreciate it. Thank you, that Mallory. Great. Thanks. All right, Ma Mallory Blackwelder. And, uh